working for you. A three-year-old loggerhead crawls back to its natural habitat. Curators at the UGA Marine Extension released a turtle from the shores of Wausau Island this morning. Yeah, it's always fascinating to watch these, isn't it? Exactly. Yeah, WJCL's Chelsea McDonald was there as Ossobaugh swam to freedom. In the last several months, one of the aquarium curators compared Ossobaugh to a rambunctious teenager who likes to make a mess of a bedroom. Why? Well, the loggerhead showed a feisty yet curious side by ripping up rocks and chewing on decor of its tank. So they knew the 40 pound three year old was outgrowing the tank. Now, Ossobaugh is somewhere around Wausau Island with a chance to live a full life. What started as a straggler hatchling the size of a half dollar has grown into an impressive 40 pounder ready to take on the sea. We're just happy that Osawa was able to make his way out to the water and give us one last kind of breath and look to say goodbye. Aquarium curator Devin Dumont has taken care of Osawa since it was a hatchling. Along with feeding, weighing and examining the loggerhead, they have a pretty special bond. Well, I talked ended up talking to it quite a bit. It's a really nice fe feeling to see it go out to the natural environment after spending so much time or devoting so much effort into making sure it's healthy. Since March, he's trained Osobal for life in the big world by throwing live food items into its tank. Live blue crabs, live spider crabs, whelks, mussels, things that are on its natural diet um, and so it could practice those foraging skills and hunting skills. He's confident Osaba will find food, but his biggest concern is predators. Sharks or larger fish, but um, humans can injure turtles with boat strikes. Fishing line and lighting issues, pollutants, just various predators out there. It's, it's a it's a rough life being a sea turtle. Before saying their last goodbyes, curators tag the turtle so it can be scanned in the future. So we can just hope that the Osaba will come back as a mature turtle. Now that Osaba is gone, the curators have a new hatchling named Ryder. Ryder will make its public debut on October 25th at Skidaway Marine Science Day. In the studio, Chelsea McDonald, WJCL News, working for you.